The Metropolitan Glasgow Strategic Drainage Partnership, the MGSDP, is a partnership formed by organisations involved in the operation of the sewerage and drainage network, including culverted and open water courses. The partnership recognises that its aims and objectives can be delivered most effectively and efficiently through collaborative and integrated working, both with the key partners, but also with other key stakeholders such as Transport Scotland, Scottish Natural Heritage, Glasgow and Clyde Valley Green Network, Strathclyde Partnership for Transport, local housing associations, community groups and the wider public. Over the next 50 years, climate change is predicted to increase the frequency and size of extreme weather events. The MGSDP recognises that it is not possible to prevent all flooding and associated water quality incidents, but the partners can reduce the risk and impacts. The MGSDP vision is to transform how the city region thinks about and manages rainfall to end uncontrolled flooding and improve water course water quality. This vision will be realised through partnership working shaped by the following guiding principles. Enhancement of our urban biodiversity and landscape. Surface water should be viewed as an asset to harness, not as a problem. Rather than putting water underground, this resource should be channelled to create natural green-blue areas which will break up the city's hard landscaping, enhance urban biodiversity and become a place for the public to enjoy. The presence of surface water will also contribute to the cooling of air, thereby helping the urban environment to further adapt to climate change. Reconnection to our waterways. Watercourses in the past were often either incorporated into the sewer network or modified to flow through buried pipes. As the water was out of sight, it became increasingly out of mind for local communities. By re-establishing this connection, communities will be encouraged to take pride once again in the local watercourse. This connection will also help in developing an awareness of flood risk as the varying depth of water during and after periods of heavy rainfall will be visible rather than hidden. Design for the severity of the rain. The impact of rainfall events varies as the intensity increases. At lower intensities, the primary impact of the events is a reduction in watercourse water quality as the rain washes pollutants off hard surfaces such as roads. As the rainfall intensity increases, flooding will become the predominant impact and could even include storm events where there is a risk of loss of life occurring. Resilience measures will be a key part of appropriate design for the severity of the rain. Presumption that water will be kept on the surface. Hard engineering solutions should be discouraged in favour of projects which keep water on the surface. This will help raise the public's awareness of their responsibility for flood risk management, as they will be able to see how storm water is managed, which in turn will require support and backing from developers, planners, design professionals and statutory bodies. It will also require, through re-education, an attitudinal change to land use and the perception of risk from surface water. Creation of integrated blue-green networks. Many of the solutions which allow water to be managed on the surface will provide opportunities to enhance the environment. By creating and developing blue-green networks and areas in the urban cityscape, it will help to manage flood risk issues, improve local habitats and enhance biodiversity. These areas should be considered in the provision of sustainable drainage systems in all new development and as part of a retrofit strategy. Integrated Urban Master Planning and Design Surface water management must be a central and integrated part of urban design and master planning. Ensuring that this becomes the new norm across the city region will require a culture change in how development is delivered and the way assets like roads are viewed and utilised. Sustainable and affordable drainage solutions 
Diverting water underground and building bigger pipes to accommodate this flow has huge capital costs attached to it. While there will always be a place for such a response, they only provide a finite solution and can only be modified by replacing what was built with something bigger. Keeping water on the surface can be more cost effective, but will often require taking novel approaches. With careful selection of methods and materials, the surface water solution can have longevity and provide additional environmental enhancements that far outweigh below ground solutions. Climate change ready. Without taking action to adapt to a changing climate, the frequency and severity of flood events in the city region is likely to increase. This window of opportunity must therefore be seized to increase the resilience of our surface water drainage infrastructure to climate change. The MGSDP is committed to making the necessary changes happen, so please do your bit to help end uncontrolled flooding, improve water quality, enable economic development and improve our habitat through integrated partnership working to make the necessary changes happen.